clamoring for scrap iron and steel for rearmament, American railroad men find a new answer to the old question, what to do with derelict goods wagons. Rattling with age, they're dragged to the breaking up yard, the wood for a bonfire, the metal for the international junk men. During the next few years, experts estimate that nearly half of the world's new steel and iron work will consist of old metal purified by fire in great furnaces. When I was at school, they used to teach me that matter is indestructible. Now I know they were right. So these may one day be shells or bombs, or perhaps just peaceful machinery.